Well, we just finished up another election night of 2019. It was an off-year election. The last quiet election we'll have for another year because next year will be a, a big one. So here are a couple takeaways from tonight. One is that it, a million dollar campaign couldn't overcome a grassroots effort to pass a Mecklenburg County sales tax, to increase the sales tax a quarter cent uh, that would have generated $50 million a year to benefit the arts and parks and greenways and education. The proponents of the tax increase spent that much money to get it passed and the opponents had a real grassroots campaign. Uh, they spent maybe $1,000 on signs uh, and Matthew Ridenauer, who led the fight against it, talked about uh, meeting people who had made their own, their own mailers, their own door knockers, and passed them out themselves. It was kind of a David Goliath thing in terms of uh, money. Uh, the other thing is that incumbents are safe and were safe in Charlotte. Uh, the September primary really decided the election uh, in most cases. There was one race tonight uh, that was still undecided or at least in question and that was a District 6 City Council race with incumbent Republican Tarek Bokhari and uh, Gina Navarrete, a, a Democrat who was running and, and Bokhari won that one. It uh, was really kind of an anticlimactic race from the city point of view and Mayor Vi Lyles became only the first mayor since 2011 to win a second term and she did it relatively e easily. Those were the main takeaways tonight. It was a pretty low-key election. Next year, we're gonna have a lot different and busier elections.